Well, hey guys, and welcome to my channel. My name is Mandy, if you're new here, and this is Sweetly Home. And we love to talk about all things heart and home here on my channel. Today, I want to share with you a little bit of a stuff haul, if you will. Um, we are going to Walt Disney World, and we leave in just a couple days. And I have been just kind of <laughs> watching so many packing videos and prepping videos, and um, some of my favorite videos that have to do with Walt Disney has been seeing what people buy before their trip, for their trip. And um, I got a lot of really great ideas from so many videos here on YouTube, and I thought I would just film my own and share with you um, a lot of the things that we have purchased for our trip. This is going to be a long video. Uh, already my camera battery is dying, so I need to go charge that, um, and I will check in with you in all of two seconds for you. Um, so grab a snack, grab a drink, because this is going to be a while, and let's get into some Mickey magic. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this video and hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in my next one. Bye. Okay, so let's get started. So something that I got was this Minnie Mouse sweatshirt, and it's got all these minis here on the sleeve. It's so cute. Um, and I actually got this at Walmart. They had so many Disney things there, like clothes and luggage and all sorts of stuff. We wanted to get the kids um, luggage because they needed some, but you know, things just start to add up after a while. Um, but I got this sweatshirt like in a big roomy oversized sort of feel. Um, and this is going to be what I'm going to wear as we leave. This is going to be kind of my driving um, outfit. Uh, it is <laughs> ridiculously cold here and snowy. We are in northern Ontario, Canada. And actually our church was canceled today because there is just so much um, ice and snow uh, and our church had no power. So we're looking forward to 80 degree weather very soon. So at Michael's, I picked up these two play packs for my kiddos. They come with crayons and stickers. They are huge Incredibles fans. In fact, my son is actually wearing his Incredible costume right now as I film. Um, they love them. So this will be something that they get on the drive down. Another thing I picked up, and I got this actually at the dollar store, was this um, moleskin. I got two packs, and I don't know if I should get one more. Um, it comes with three sheets in the packs um, and I'm hoping that it's an okay brand and um, it's from the Dollar Tree but I'm guessing moleskin is moleskin so hopefully it works works good but got two packs of this I also got a new tube of toothpaste um, I actually use a different brand of toothpaste I use on guard from doTERRA but I'm almost out of that and I don't have time to order new so I just got some good old um, Colgate total from the grocery store I picked up a little first aid kit. We have one of these in our truck. Um, this was just from the grocery store. It comes with four antiseptic wipes, two alcohol swabs, two burn relief cream pads, three latex free fabric um, band-aids, more band-aids, and more band-aids. So we've got a lot of band-aids in here. And then I'm also going to tuck in just a few other things for our park bag. Um, you know, little medicines and different things like that, just on the knock on wood case. Hopefully we don't have to use this, um, but this was just a couple bucks. Oh, this is just random when weird, but my husband loves these like little toothpickies and I found, um, this little carrying case at the grocery store um and so I'm gonna throw these in our park bag because he always uses these toothpicks uh and afterwards they'll just kind of stay in our truck in this little thing he likes cling to I mean who doesn't right um and then this is just really random but I needed some um heat protectant spray for my hair it's been a long time since it's been cut and it was on sale so just kind of going through the bags, I guess. It's all been kind of piled up. Um, okay. We got rain ponchos. I have four of them. Um, and I just ordered them on Amazon. I couldn't find them at my Dollar Tree. And then I found them last night. And I'm almost thinking of getting a couple more. Um, it is calling for rain while we're there. Um, so we'll take, like, jackets and stuff and our umbrellas. But I don't know. 
they're only like a buck 25 in Canada things are $1.25 at our Dollar Tree so we might just get a couple more just because um, there's another one and then I got a pack of baby wipes um, this was something that came very highly recommended from a lot of videos that I watched just to clean hands clean faces clean surfaces um, and I loved that they were Mickey okay so I got um, some uh, blister band-aids and they're supposed to cushion and protect um, the gel pads help reduce pain and promote healing so I picked up some of those I mean let's hope we don't get blisters but I mean the reality let's be honest um, okay this is weird but I have a really bad back um, I go to the chiropractor I go three times a week I have a problem with my hip where it's actually separated and I just am in a lot of pain all the time so um, I ended up getting some of this pain relief cream it's a no odor kind but it's kind that you just rub on your um, aches and pains your muscles and your joints and things um, and I have a feeling that from doing so much walking I'm gonna need this big time so um, I just got the off-brand the drugstore brand um, pain relief cream and a girlfriend needs some razors so I got some razors and then this was at the checkout <laughs> Um, I think this is going to be good reading on our way down. It's the... That's going to be good. I'm excited. Disney looks so friendly. Don't you just want to know, Walt? What a guy. Okay, so one thing that a lot of people mentioned was that you should bring some dish soap and like a cloth or something or sponge to wash your reusable mugs. Um, we're on the Disney dining plan. While they do have wash stations, um, it was really recommended that you do bring like sponges and a bit of dish soap so you can wash those things. We're gonna be there for um, seven days. So yeah, um, so I just got these from the, from the Dollar Tree and I'll just put a bit of soap inside of um, a reusable container. We're also going to bring like our own personal water bottles for the drive and stuff and we are going to be traveling for a few days beforehand and then traveling a few days to get home and I just don't want to rely just on regular water to clean those kind of things. So next thing I got was um, these two shower caddies and the reason I got these was for my kiddos. Um, they're both in um, car seat there's they're both in car seats um and I thought rather than just having their stuff like set beside them on the seat sometimes the chairs like make it difficult to reach um down because the chairs are big and I thought anyways it would be better to have their things like their coloring books and their car games and different stuff in these containers so that they can kind of reach the handles and then pull them up and also I'm hoping that these will keep the truck just a little bit more organized because we've done a lot of road trips and things go everywhere and I also thought this would be good to hold um their snacks and food uh like if we stop for fast food or stop to eat or whatever um and we're eating in the car the truck whatever um to put it in these so we'll see how that goes and i need some new cotton rounds for my facial toner so pick some of those up and i also needed some like traveling tissues to put in our park bag and just in our truck in general but I thought this pattern was really kind of fun um these were from the Dollar Tree they did have Disney ones but they were three for a dollar 25 and this was six and why not just get more right so I'm gonna do another video about this whole subject but I'm gonna do some things um some extra magic things for my family and they don't know about it yet so I'm kind of secluded in this room, hoping that they don't hear what's going on. Um, but I'm going to have a video, kind of all of the extra magic stuff that I'm going to do. But I picked up a few things that I just thought I'd show you. Um, but one of the things is I'm going to give them like treats and stuff. But I found these um, Evian waters uh, at the Dollar Tree. And they're, you know, Donald and Daisy. And they did have... Um, 
Pluto and or not Pluto they had Goofy and Minnie and I'm assuming they must have had Mickey and the whole gang um but these are the ones that I saw and I thought these were so cute for my son and daughter and they're adorable so they'll probably be for a ride down I'm guessing and then another part of our little extra magic is to give them little treats each night and one of them would be a cup they both actually need new cups um at home so I got mini for my daughter and this one for my son and I loved this one because it actually has a mickey bar on it like how cute is that so they had a couple different styles of the Disney characters, but those were my favorites. Okay, so this thing is a little random. I don't know if we're going to end up using it, but I got it just in case. So about 25. Okay, so they are these Disney snack boxes. And my thought was, because they're flat, I could stick them in our park bag. And if we get a shareable item like popcorn, I can fill the kids I can fill little boxes for the kids um, and that would be easier to just kind of walk and snack or whatever having their own little container rather than just sharing in the community popcorn. That's my thought. Um, we'll also have snacks in our room and maybe even snacks on the, well we will have snacks on the drive. Um, but yeah, I don't know. So I don't know if these how these are going to work out but they might. Um, I'm thinking and then I also thought they may actually even fit in here so I could fill these up with you know pretzels or whatever for our drive um, just so that they have a container for them but they're Disney themed and they're cute so I thought we'd give those a go. Um, I picked up this really stinking cute um, clear case and this again was from the Dollar Tree. It's just a little cosmetic bag but it's clear and it has these little pineapples on it and I thought this would be great for my park bag because from what I understand um, you have to open up your bag and open up all your cases and show everything that's inside but if it's clear you don't necessarily have to open it up so um, I was looking for more clear bags like this because I do have some loose items um, but I'm going to try and put as many loose items as I can into one of these clear bags so that I can just kind of get through the line quickly. I don't want to hold people up um, and I just want to get in the park quickly. So the more that I can do that, the better. Okay, so <laughs> one thing that was really recommended was to... Um, buy glow sticks and things like that beforehand so that you, when you're at the parades and things your kiddos are hopefully not going to beg so much for all of the light up toys that are at Disney um because mama already has some stuff and mama found some stuff so I'm not totally opposed to buying you know like something light up but if I have things it'll really help deter my kids from the wanting so we got a bunch of stuff I got um, two packs of glow stick necklaces. I know my husband is probably going to want to wear some, and I thought I would too, so we got two packs of those. And then I got two of these wands, and um, they have six glow sticks in them, three red, three white, and a handle. So I thought these would be kind of fun to wave around. Um, and so we'll do different things of these each night so that we can kind of spread them out. And then I got a pack of glow bracelets and there's 20 in here. And then these were so super awesome. I was really excited to find these. But they have um, character um in the dark things. So we got a Mickey and an Avengers one for my son. And then for my daughter we got um, Frozen. And then this thing was a glow in the dark bracelet set. Um, this is kind of what it looks like here. So anyways I thought that was really kind of neat you put that together. So I don't know how I'm going to do that. If I'm going to put assemble this ahead of time or what but I'll figure that out okay so now we're heading into 
my big bag here. This is a bag I actually got for her trip. It's enormous. I didn't think it was going to be as big as it was, but it's from Land's End and it's one of their um, tote bags. Initially, I thought it would be a park bag, but it's really huge, so I don't think that that's going to happen. I did not want a park bag, like a backpack style, because again, my back is really bad, and for me, it just the idea of having something weighing on my back, like, ooh, I'm much better with a shoulder bag, so, um, yes, that was, that was my thinking, but I think this bag is way too big. Okay, so when we told our kiddos that we were going on a Disney trip, um, we have filled this box at Christmas with all kinds of Disney related things and one of the things in it was some Scentsy items because I love Scentsy um and they have they've partnered with Disney and they have all kinds of like Scentsy buddies and um wax bars and all kinds of things that are Disney so one of the things I got to hang in our truck was this um Mickey scent circle so it smells up your vehicle and makes it smell lovely and it was Mickey so we're driving so it makes sense um and this is just something that i've had kind of forever but i stuck it in my bag i'm gonna put um my id and just any pertinent cards in here rather than carrying my wallet around um we hope to just you know kind of use our magic bands for any purchases and kind of put our credit card on the magic band um but for id and just for <laughs> that sort of reason I'm definitely going to have one of these because, yeah, no. Okay. Okay, so more band-aids. We got um, the Mickey band-aids. So cute. And, oh my gosh, I didn't even see what they looked like. <laughs> Those are adorable. I got them on Amazon, but they also had them at my grocery store. They were cheaper on Amazon, though. Um... I just have the kids' sunglasses in here. I kind of been stashing stuff in this bag so that I had it when I was ready. Um, and I got them coloring books. I got these at um, Michael's. They were $1.50. In the States, they're probably a dollar, but here they were $1.50. Um, and these will be for some point in the trip. And this is not necessarily Disney related, but I did think I, I thought I would show you. Um, I have this little um, case here and it can't, like I bought it to go with my bag because they match and it has little um, RVs on them, the trailers. I think it's so cute. I have kind of a, an obsession with little Shastas and things. So um, anyways, I put that in there. Um, I'm almost done actually. I'm surprised. I thought I had a lot more, but I'm almost done. Okay, so I'll show you a couple things. So I'm an American living in Canada, and um, I love the USA. <laughs> I love shopping in the USA. Uh, my in laws went across the border and did some shopping a little while ago, and um, they got some stuff for us for our trip and they got the kids some shirts and the kids don't know about these yet. These are going to be a gift for on our trip, but they got this at Target. This is for my son. And I love that the sleeve has these little guys. And this was on clearance for only seven bucks. So it's cute. And this is the one for my daughter. I wish I had this in my size. It's so cute. And it looks like it almost could go inside out, but that's what it looks like on the inside of the shirt. I love it. It's so cute. Um, maybe I'll show you a couple of the shorts I got for my daughter and my son. I also got myself a loofah puff. I needed one of these. Okay, so I got I ordered stuff from Carter's because my kids needed shorts, and we will not be in shorts weather here for months. Uh, and my kiddos grew, so they needed some things. My son, not so much. And as I look at these, these may be too big on him, but he's really tiny, and these look enormous. 
I don't think these are gonna fit him. I think they're gonna be too big. He's in between, he's five, and he's in between a 5T and a 4T. Um, these just look really big, so we'll see about this. Um, and I got these for my daughter. Actually, I need to pick up her one more pair of shorts because she only had like one or two pairs, but these are, were little shorts for her. And they've got little ruffles here. So cute. I wish they came in adult sizes. I honestly wish I could go to Carter's and shop for me because they have such cute stuff. And this pair of shorts. And this is not Disney related. This is actually going to be for Easter. Her Easter dress. I thought it was too cute. I thought I'd show you because I'm opening it. But it's this little skirt. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. So I'll have like a little cardigan and that will be her Easter. I'm going to hide it in my desk for now. I love to surprise my kids. Okay. Um, and then the last thing, this was so super fun. So I mentioned doing like all of that extra magic stuff for my family. And this is one of the things. I'm trying to talk quiet so they don't hear. Um, but when my in-laws were shopping, they got... These guys. And y'all... Can I just show you the price? $2.50. Now granted, they were originally only $5, but I can't imagine like buying these at the park when these are only $2.50. So my plan is to have these sitting on the bed for when we come back our first night. And I got my husband and I one too, because you know. Just Okay, so I guess that's everything. Um, I thought there was a lot more. It feels like there's a lot more. It feels like I've been doing a lot of shopping. I also realize that there's the garbage in the background. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm just trying to get this filmed really quickly. So I actually have some t-shirts to iron because I've made most of our shirts. Um, I've got my vinyl sitting up here ready to go. This is one I did for my daughter. Um, and I need to get those ironed. So anyways, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today and I will see you in my next video.